five kayaks, 20 plus kayakers, and God knows the number of people who helped to organize this kayaking from Malacca to Port Dixon. All for this man's birthday, Bob Tan. He was going to celebrate his 70th birthday in style. The kayakers assembled at a beach in PD on Saturday afternoon. It was election day for Selangorians, so we had to quickly vote and make our way down to PD. This bus took us to Malacca. Muna and Carol met with a small accident, but they managed to make it to the bus too. I slept all the way. Dinner that night was at Big Ben's. The birthday boy even sang for our supper. The next morning, we were taken to a small port at sunrise. The mayor of Malacca came to flag us off. We were served breakfast before Bob and the mayor gave a small press conference. While the first batch of kayakers took off, the rest of us followed them aboard the Merrily. The organizers had thought of everything. There was plenty of food and water on board. They even got Stanley to be a safety boat and Zili as a first aider. Morning looked gloomy and there were flashes of lightning in the distance. The water became choppy but the kayakers paddled on. After two hours, the second batch of kayakers swapped places. I was in this batch. It seemed to me that no matter how hard we paddled, we weren't going anywhere. The waves and the undercurrent were very different from paddling in the river. I only paddled for an hour and a half before surrendering to the third batch of kayakers. And so, that was pretty much how the day went, swapping kayakers and being rescued by Stanley and Zili. At about noon, the sea and weather became too rough and the decision was made to skip a small but dangerous section of the sea. Once in the clear, we set the kayaks out and paddle again, taking turns. At about 3 p.m., 10 kayakers, including Bob the birthday boy, got into the kayaks to paddle the last stretch. The short distance took more than two hours. The rest of us waited at the beach to welcome them. Yeah, we have JC and Jared. <laughs> During the dinner, certificates were handed out while some asked whose 70th birthday is next, huh? I think everybody's 70th birthday should be as exciting as this.